When his plans to open a permanent haunted attraction didn't work out, well, Justin Smith just went back to doing what he does best. And that's scaring his neighbors and friends and our Renee Bonneau. On this peaceful Plymouth street lurks a dark, deranged secret. Essentially, it's an orphanage that the students have taken over the establishment. It gets real intense from here. Justin Smith takes us through his 10th homemade haunted house. One of our regulars, this is Shannon. Which, like the others before it, is built in his parents' garage. We started when uh, in 2000, when I was in 8th, 9th grade. Me and a bunch of my friends, we went to Benoist St. Margaret's High School, and uh, we were just like six friends who just enjoyed uh, enjoyed Halloween, enjoyed horror movies, just enjoyed having fun. They enjoyed it so much they wanted to run a permanent haunted attraction all year round in this warehouse in Golden Valley and wanted to call it Disturbia in Suburbia. Someone else outbid us on the location so we lost the location and then they got to the point where if we were going to open this year it'd be really rushed and we didn't want to push it. Instead they refocused their efforts here. Smith says he usually doesn't spend too much on these haunted houses. Most of the props are recycled. But this year, money that would have gone into Disturbia and Suburbia and Golden Valley is now being poured into this haunted house. They just got rabid. Smith says his elaborate setup will thrill fans who come in the hundreds each year, some from as far away as Elk River and Rockford. They wanted to see it and it's become what I think is a, a tradition for, for most people in the neighborhood, at least if not the city. In Plymouth, Renee Bonneau, 12 News. And the haunted house is open Saturday, Sunday, and of course on Halloween. It's located near 60th Place North and Kirkwood Lane in Plymouth. It is free, but Smith is collecting food donations for his church. And if you thought you saw everything in there, you didn't. <laughs> uh, he, he didn't show us some of the things on purpose because he still wants that to be a surprise. That's so. right. There's got to be more to it, come. It right? should be interesting. <laughs>